the color on point love the color it's the exact color that i want this is chef's kiss perfect the quality not so much I'm feeling so lazy that I'm about to do my makeup in the bed. I got my makeup right here in this bag. And uh, we gonna get to it. All right. We got this makeup done. All I gotta do is tame down these baby hairs on the side. Bump a few curls and we good to go. We good to go. I literally um, did my hair and makeup in the bed while watching All American. I feel so lazy. I'm so mad. I just ordered some um, buffalo wings and I almost ordered some, I mean, not almost. I ordered some buffalo wings and some beer batter fries with some ranch sauce. And it just got here, but I'm not eating it until I finish this video. So, yeah. Okay. The shirt come irritate me. But whatever. Okay, I got my notes on my laptop that I'm about to pull up so that I can have my reference my reference points right here. Cause I be ranting. I be ranting. I be ranting. When it comes to me, um that's the uh laundry machine in the background if you hear like some noise. But why does she keep on messaging me? I just switched over car insurances and this lady keeps emailing me. Like, what What could there be more to talk about? And then like, she be making her email sound urgent and it don't even be nothing. It just be a promotion. Like, and it's like, I can't unsubscribe because my car insurance lady, like it's her, um, it's her agency, it's Allstate, but it's her personal, you know how they be doing, like they, they like build their own personal insurance companies under the big branch so it's like her personally that i'm working with and it's like i don't want to unsubscribe to her because she could probably be telling me some important stuff every now and then but dang she just be messaging me every day anyway um my reference points here perfect why does everything keep saying one Okay, anyway, we're about to get started with this video, y'all. So, I got my water just in case my throat be getting, be acting funny. What is that in my water? Uh-uh, what? What is going on here? Ugh, whatever. I'm just going to start this video. Okay, so I just finished recording my video. I'm so happy. Um, it was the six things, six key things you should know before starting a business video. So if you are interested, go ahead and check that out because that video is going to be up more than likely before this video. Yeah, I ordered me some buffalo wings that I'm about to go smash right now. They got here right before I started working on this video. And I was like, dang it, now I'm going to be tempted to eat a buffalo wing, but I didn't do it. I didn't do it. I waited until I was done with this video. Talk about discipline. My discipline has really been on point today. It has. Because I did not feel like doing this video. I did not feel like doing it. But I'm keeping up with this 25 days of Lashmas content. I am not letting up. We're getting to it. Honey, we are getting to it. So, yeah. So, yeah. Go check out that video, y'all. If you're thinking about start, So, yeah. If you're thinking about starting a business, if you already have a business, Hey girl bosses, so I just finished my workout um, and now I'm at the last studio. I'm about to go pick up some mail and then I'm about to go run a few errands. I'm thinking of going to Best Buy to get um, another camera because like, because the way that Vlogmas is set up, what happens to record, edit, upload every day. I didn't get to record that much 
pre-vlogmas content so it's pretty much like i'm going day by day and um my goal is just to upload a video related to um my business every day until the 25th of december it doesn't matter what it is whether it's a shorts video whether it's a sit down video talking about something business related whether it's a day in the life the, whether it's a day in the life of a lash tech whatever but um you know that the the pace doesn't stop so i need to go to best buy so that i can get one another macbook and a new camera YouTube is an income for me now and I have to like you know treat it as a priority so this MacBook and this camera is definitely a priority so I can continue pushing out content that helps elevate my business because although it's like it's not necessarily a wing of Lash Ray Boulevard because um it's like a separate job in itself but it has a lot to do with Lash Ray Boulevard because I come here to talk about my business which ultimately helps elevate my business if that makes sense so yeah basically say that to say camera and macbook is on the um agenda for today and then i'm gonna go to epic nutrition get me my drink so yes let's run these errands today so i got my vitamin drink you already know where it's from and then we are at best buy about to get us a new camera and a macbook so i researched the camera that i want um, it's the Sony camera and it's supposed to be good for vlogging. It also comes with the fuzzy thing on the top so that, um, when I'm talking the volume and is like, it's very good and there's like no, no static. So that's what I like about it. I think I'm gonna get the white one cause the white one was really cute. I'm thinking about this Mac. It's only, um, it was not a thousand and I was eight ninety nine. Nothing too fancy, nothing too current because i'm literally just gonna be using this to edit and work so that my personal mac doesn't have to like have no storage i just spent just spent 1700 dollars in best buy <sighs> what it takes to be an entrepreneur um so yes, I got a new MacBook, a new camera, and an SD card. The camera that I got is the Sony camera here. Sony ZV-1 is supposed to be one of the best vlogging cameras. And then um, the MacBook that I got is just the regular MacBook Air. I didn't get too fancy with it because like I said, I already got a MacBook. And this is literally just going to be used to edit. And then I also got a SD card too. So yes, that's everything that I got from Best Buy. Um, I'll probably like open it and show y'all when I get home. If not, then the vlog after this, or if not the vlog after this, then the vlog after that will be used with my new camera, elevation, better content, better quality, all that. Okay, so I'm about to show y'all a better view of what I got. I already opened the camera up so I could put it together and everything. It looks like this. So I was um looking at some of the best cameras as far as like vlogging and content creation. This came up as one of the best and they compared it a lot to the Canon G7X camera. And everybody knows that the Canon G7X is like, or it was the camera that everybody just raved about over and over again. But I follow, or I subscribe to a lot of vloggers up on here and they would just always be complaining about their how their viewfinder on the Canon G7X would break or like just something like on the lens would just be hanging and stuff. And then I'm just like, I don't have time for that. So I went with the next best thing next to it. And it's specifically made for content creators. So not to say that the um, other cameras aren't made for content creation, but I guess this camera specifically was made for content creation in mind. Although it's a lot of good quality cameras. So yeah, it's the Sony ZV-1 or something like that. I think I showed the, um, the box in my last clip. And then there's the viewfinder. A viewfinder was a non-negotiable for me when it came to um, 
fit in the camera because I need to see if I'm in focus or not. And I just need to make sure I don't look crazy. So yeah, oh, here it goes. Bye. Thumbnail. <laughs> and then, the one that whew, definitely had me doing some damage today is the MacBook that I got. I actually wanted the pink one. He brought me back the silver one. And I low-key did not even realize it until um, I got into my truck. But I'm like, I'm not going back in there and it's never that serious. So, MacBook Air. Dang it. I actually should have got the pink one because I should have told him I wanted the pink one. I should have went back up in there because my regular MacBook is this color. And I don't ever want to get um, this one confused with my personal one because say for instance, I'm going somewhere and I hurry up and I just grab my MacBook and it ends up being my personal one when I need my business one. Gotta be. Because I'm going to keep all my editing software and um, my camera footage, everything that I need for filming videos and just business in general on here. Hmm. I'll just put a sticker on it. <laughs> I'm not going back up there, y'all. Now, when I open this, when I pull this flap, it is official. It is official. Thumbnail. When I put this flap, ain't no going back. Cause you know the moment you um open something and the moment you drive off in something, the value depreciates. But hey, I ain't playing around when it comes to my business, so I did it, it's done. We're just gonna click to use English as the main language. English. Press the return key. Hey y'all, so I got a package in the mail and I wanted to come on here and talk about it because this is um a package for hold on. So here it is. It is a pink hoodie and um this actually came way faster than what they said it was gonna come. They said it was gonna take 14 days for me to receive this sample. It came in three. I feel like companies just say that so you can order express shipping and pay the thousand dollars more. So this is the um, pink hoodie. If you watched my previous videos, then you will know that I am going to be dropping a hoodie line soon. And I'm in the process of testing vendors. Now, um, the color on point, love the color. It's the exact color that I want. This is chef's kiss, perfect. The quality, not so much what I want. Um, and it's not bad quality, it's actually pretty good, but I don't want good, I don't want pretty good, I want great. And uh, it's just a little too thin for me. When I wear hoodies, I like padded, um, soft cotton insides. And that's just not what this is giving. Let me feel the inside first, actually, before I even say that. Okay, so the inside is soft and it is cotton, but it's just not padded the way I like. It's too thin. Like, let me put it to this side so you can actually see. Yeah, it's just, it's it's a thin hoodie. And when I'm wearing hoodies, especially in the winter time, I like the hoodies to actually keep me warm, not just look cute. So, um, probably won't be going with this hoodie. Now, the good thing about where I ordered this sample from is that I order, I mean, is that they have quite a few different styles of hoodies. They have, like, so many things, actually. They have windbreakers. They have um, crew necks. They have uh hoodies with the what is this called the pouch the kangaroo pouch and then they have them without it they have zip up jackets everything but <clears throat> i'm not feeling this one i should have ordered more than one sample but i, I didn't want to waste money not necessarily knowing if this was going to be the company that i liked but i mean that is the culture of ordering and testing samples so yeah i should have ordered more than one so yeah, I love the color, just don't like how thin it is. I don't like um, 
that there isn't more pay. That's okay because <clears throat> I'm ahead of the game. I also have another company that I'm testing as well. This location is actually a physical location. I went there yesterday and um, I was just getting a feel of how long the turnover rate is for receiving your products, like what they can do, given like trying to see some examples of what they can do, just asking all those questions. But the main question I didn't ask that I should have asked was do they provide samples? So I'm gonna call up there today to see if they do. And yeah, but um, hopefully that company is the winner because it's literally not that far away from me. They provide the hoodies and the customization. So like, you know, I could just get all that right there. I don't have to just, you know, be ordering my orders from here, then taking it here to go get customized, then bringing it back here and packaging. I could just literally order it from that one company. They will provide the hoodies and the customizations and then I will pick them up and I'll package them the way I see fit. So, I wanted to come on the vloggy vlog vlog and share that with you all. The end of vlog right here for today. I look so crazy. My hair is so crazy. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to subscribe to the Girl Wash Tribe because you know we're a vibe. Look at me just taking this further and further. <laughs> um, yes, yeah, subscribe to the Girl Wash Tribe though, y'all. Also turn your post notifications on so that you don't miss a beat. And I'll see you in my next video. Until next time. Mwah!